We open tonight with the possibility of North Korea conducting its fourth nuclear test or undertaking another submarine ballistic missile launch in the near future. And the South's readiness against such provocations. These are some of the subjects discussed by top military officials on Monday. Kim Hyun bin has more from Seoul's Defense Ministry. During a meeting of military commanders on Monday to evaluate all aspects of South Korea's military, including its improvements, a security assessment from North Korea emphasized the continued nuclear and ballistic missile threats the regime poses. The Ministry of National Defense responded, saying South Korea's military will retain its readiness to counter those possible threats. The Ministry of National Defense and the Joint Chiefs of Staff will also maintain their joint readiness posture towards North Korea's nuclear testing and missile launches. South Korea will upgrade its anti-missile defense system under the South Korea-United States alliance. Speaking in front of 150 generals and heads of defense-related government organizations, Defense Minister Han ming emphasized that North Korea's leader, Kim Jong-un, displays a constant reign of terror, and that the South's military needs to stand fast against the communist regime's unpredictable military provocations. Han also emphasized that South Korea's military's unchanging value is to win wars under any circumstances. The ministry also says Korea plans to increase its counterterrorism abilities next year to better guard against security threats from Pyongyang. This includes establishing a cyber defense research center to counter the North's growing cyber threats. Kim Hyun-bin, Arirang News.